Hello to our East Lyme families and happy Friday to you. Um, we've had another great week here, chock full of a lot of different activities, a lot of different happenings. So here we are for another five at five. Mrs. Anusowitz, can you give us an, uh, an update on some of the things that are coming? Sure. So our first update for this week, this relates to the Viking Voices Survey, which is powered by Satchel Pulse. So to our returning families, if you recall last spring, you got quite a few notifications in regard to signing up for Satchel Pulse to be able to take our survey. And for our new families, that is something that we are gonna be utilizing four times throughout the year. Um, what I have in my hand is correspondence we gave out at Back to School Night, and you will receive this as well for Infinite Campus. And it's gonna pertain to having a link in the document, a code to use that relates to East Line Middle School, and then it'll allow you to sign up and register if you don't have an account already, either with your phone or email. From there, the Satchel Pulse survey does open October 7th to all families, and you will be able to answer a few questions, add any um, commentary if you wish, and then we will use that information to help uh, further build our school. Additionally, if you already have an account with Satchel Pulse, then you will be able to um, go into your account and switch the school that you were initially registered with to East Line Middle School. And Shannon, we do have um, a district-wide uh, committee um, relying on culture and climate, and we're gonna be um, further enhancing that with the school-based one. So families input is important. That's Absolutely. something that's reviewed, and it gives us an opportunity to review to continually kind of upgrade, make tweaks and changes based on the feedback that families give. Absolutely, your voice is so important to us, and we really hope that we can get as much participation as possible. Awesome, so please do sign up, and if you have um, questions or need assistance, reach out. Don't hesitate yes. to reach out, we're here to help. Um, also for our families, just to kind of touch base, we do have many of our teams that are starting to yeah. embark on field trips. Um, a lot of in the fall is team building activities. I know we have several teams going to Camp Hazen yes. to really um, help, um, especially our grade five, grade seven, because it is a new team coming together. Team building um, and opportunities for um, them to get to kind of work with your teachers outside of the school setting and for kids and students to get to know each other a little bit better outside. So um, and Camp Hazen is a great place. So just be cognizant of dates and you know just dressing and attire and weather and all of that. So we just wanted to offer that again. Um, at, at, again, back to school night, uh, there was a slide that was presented um, on some of the teams with regards to yearbook sales. Um, Mrs. Wojtovich, um thankfully has taken over as our advisor for yearbook. Um, so there is an opportunity, a message also did go out in Infinite Campus, so please look for that, especially for our grade eight families. Um, there's an early bird opportunity to sign up. Um, and to, I guess, get personalization yeah, and some other icons in there that can be included without additional cost. So please make reference to that. And then lastly, um, we have already started with um, some of our staff planning for the upcoming Veterans Day Assembly. We are gonna recognize Veterans Day here at middle school on the 11th, which is Veterans Day. So we've already had a couple sessions. Um, it's a big day here, it's a wonderful day here. So to our families, if you are a veteran, Stay tuned for more to come. We would love to have your participation in a panel and share your experiences and your um, opportunity um, to share and give back to our students uh, your experience in whatever branch of the service that you did represent. And um, give an update, we'd love to have you. As I said, it's one of my favorite days. It it's, awesome. it's just a wonderful day and I'm glad our kids are in school on that day. Um, it's a lot more meaningful and I really think that our students um, get a lot out of it. And I think the other thing that's really awesome is we encompass all elements. We have our students performing um, in the chorus, singing and playing um, instruments in the band for, um, you know, kind of when we're in the gymnasium yeah. for the assembly. Our art department and our students do a great job um, with regards to um, making our vets feel welcome. And then we have our teams um, on panel that do a lot of really great work. And then the thank you notes I know are very touching to our veterans. So more to come with that. We would love um, as much participation as we can. And I know that our food service also prepares an outstanding lunch every year. Yes. So um, big day here. We're looking forward yes. to coming. Um, hope everybody has a great weekend. Thank you for taking the time to listen to us. And as always, reach out with any questions or concerns. And um, catch you next week. Five at five. Bye, everybody.